Hey everybody, Necro VMX here, and uh, time for a GameCube collection update. I got a bunch of games for you. I got one, two, three, four, five, six games to show you, four of which I bought today uh, while I was out game hunting, and two of which came a couple of days ago in a, uh, for eBay. So let me just let me just move all these Game Boys and shit out of the way. And uh, I'll show you what I got. These games out of the way. And another Game Boy. I got Game Boys everywhere. Okay, so let's take a look at what we got. Alright, here I got Dave Mira's Freestyle BMX 2. And as you can see, I got a really good deal on this. I only paid $3.00. Sports games typically go down in value very quickly. This was, as far as I know, the last Dave Mira Freestyle BMX game. Uh, they were working on the third game, Dave Mira Freestyle BMX 3, um, and that game wound up becoming BMX Triple X. They basically wanted to do like a kind of a softcore porno version of the BMX style game. I don't know why. This one was supposedly pretty good, but then that one, they just went gimmicky with it. And then I believe Dave Mira wanted his name taken off of it after what he saw they were uh, doing with it. As you can see, there's the back of it. See, this one's rated T, so they kind of made a big jump there. And as you can see, I got all the inserts and everything, and the disc is uh, looking good there. Okay. Second game, I got Pac-Man World 2. That goes along with, uh, I already have Pac-Man World 3, and I already have uh, Pac-Man Fever. So the only Pac-Man game left on GameCube is Versus Pac-Man, I think. I gotta get my hands on that. But here we have Pac-Man World 2. Um, this one cost me $6, as you can see there. And uh, there's the back of it. And as you can see, this one also has the insert. I actually wanted this game a long while ago. There's some kind of sticker on the disc itself. Huh. Let's see how kind of shape the disc is in. Well, it's a little smudged and scratched, but it should play. If not, it'll definitely play in the Wii. For some reason, games play better in the Wii than the GameCube anyway. And that's what I've been using. Uh, here we have Reign of Fire. Now, this is based on some kind of, like movie bait with dragons you know i actually saw it and it was the only movie i ever actually fell asleep while watching it now admittedly i had been up all night but i figured that the movie might hold my interest it was the most boring thing i'd ever seen in my life um and i got it for five dollars i mainly went after cheap games today um let's take a look on the inside all right no instruction manual for this one but hell it's not like i'm gonna play it anyway here we have Battalion Wars. Uh, this is the... I think this is the latest. I don't know if they've done a Wii or a DS version yet, but it's. I think it's the latest on a long, long series that started way back on the NES with Famicom Wars. You guys are probably more familiar with Advance Wars or Game Boy Advance. Actually, I think there was one for the DS now that I think of it. Uh, yep, yeah, I got the... <laughs> this is Field Manual. And there's the... Uh, inserts and everything and the disc itself and uh, I got this one for nine dollars now this is uh, one of the two that I got on eBay this is NCAA college football 2k3 from Sega Sports insert and everything and the disc is in I would call that pristine condition I mean look at that not a scratch or a scuff or a smudge or anything it's in Absolutely, this is in mint condition, I would say. And uh, speaking of which, I got this mainly because it came with this one. This is the rarest GameCube game there is, NCAA College Basketball 2K3. It's the only college basketball game on the GameCube, and um, it had a very low print run. So let's take a look. As you can see, i got all the inserts. And once again, this is a disc that's in, I would call... Mint or near... I, I would call this one near mint because I do actually see a little... Well, no, actually, I wouldn't even call it that. This one's obviously been played. The football one, I don't think anybody's ever played it. But I got the two of them for $50. So basically, if you think about it, I got this for $25, which is amazing. Because if you look on eBay right now, there's people asking for upwards of $80 to $100 for it. So that's pretty cool. So, um, a pretty good haul... I got two big ones on eBay, including perhaps the rare, not the most valuable, but definitely the rarest GameCube game there is, NCAA College Basketball 2K3, 
NCAA College Football 2K3, Battalion Wars, Reign of Fire, Pac-Man World 2, and Dave Mira Freestyle BMX 2. So, like I said, pretty good haul. I'll see you guys later with uh, some more videos. Enjoy.